Hey buddy, how's my favorite nephew doing? Oh, your mom invited me over for the barbecue today and told me that she was doing the grilling? Not that women shouldn't be grilling, I'm just saying. You just caught me off guard. Hope she doesn't get the meat too black. Can I say that anymore? Black? Uh, arrest me, PC police, maybe? Hey sport, you like my hat? You see, I'm unaware of the fact that this hat is actually making fun of people like me. <laughs> no, this beer's pretty good. Curvita to Kate, made in Mexico. Did your mom buy this or did Mexico pay for it? Because <laughs> because they should, I believe that. I didn't say anything. You know, I got some interesting articles you should look at. Might change your mind about some of those amigos running around the country, if you know what I'm saying. Did you get that link I sent you on Facebook? Yeah, it was the one that I posted to your wall instead of just sending it to you in a message. The one about Muslims from Liberty Freedom Movement Truth Org.gun. I'll send it again. Yeah. Hey, did you accept my Facebook friend request? I have a really unique profile picture. You must have seen it. It was a photo of me sitting in my pickup truck with some sports shades on. It was taken from a very low angle. I was not smiling. Didn't see that one? I'll send it again. Hey, I heard somebody got a girlfriend. It's a she, right? Like it's a, like it's a female woman? All right. Just asking. I didn't say anything. You know, just because I saw you were hanging out with that guy, Andrew, with the bow ties and the hair gel and the... Whatever you can call them these days. Gay. But I didn't say nothing. Are you still going to that liberal arts college? <laughs> but they don't let you say it pledge before school. Liberty and let me one nation. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America. To the allegiance for which it stands. And to the republic for which, let me finish, for which it stands. One, I know you know it, let me finish. One nation under. Honor God! That's my favorite part. Uh, you know, back when men were men, I used to say the pledge every single day before class, all six years of high school. Uh, what's your major? Bet it's something stupid like anything other than construction. Oh yeah, you still studying hard to get a higher paying job to improve your family, yourself, and your community? Fucking snowflake. Oh, you're going into psychiatry? Read my mind, read my mind, read my mind. Bet you can't, idiot. Really proud of you though. Hold on, do you, do you know that guy? Do we know him? The dark, the... You know, the dark, the darker, the darker gentleman over there. Do we know him? Is he with us? Just, okay, okay. I'm just, uh, hey, I'm just asking. I'm just saying. Not that, not because he would, you know, he looks, I just mean if I was, I'm afraid of, of white people too, so. I didn't know if he was a gangster or a, maybe a, or maybe a, a rapper with a bad, with a bad tantrum. He could have been either or. Not that I don't think his life matters. I'm a, I think that all of them, I, if it's up to me, honestly, all of the lives would matter. You know, you're my favorite nephew, but you got a lot to learn. You just need to have some perspective. You see, kid, right now, you're nothing but a measly grad student who is on the dean's list and has traveled to multiple countries and interacted with people from every single facet of life, while I am a man in my early 50s who has worked at the same steel mill since high school, never left the state of Arkansas, and still likes to use the word oriental. But you'll learn, kid. <laughs>